439 here on KHTS. Mathnasium of Canning Country is now open on Golden Valley Road across from the Target Shopping Center. They've been open for a couple of years, but business is booming. Five-star review after five-star review on Yelp, on the website, everywhere. Joining me in studio right now is Q Reed, Center Director of Mathnasium of Canyon Country. Q, long time no see. Hi, Aaron. How are you? I'm doing well. I'm doing well. The, the past couple times that you've been scheduled, you've been sick. How are you feeling? I am feeling much better, thank you. You know what? It, it's a bug that's going around. I yeah. swear, there was at least seven people sick here last yeah. week. I caught it. It was brutal. It was. I was speaking yeah. like this on the radio. You should have heard, oh. you should have heard Tori. <laughs> she was even worse. Sorry, Tori. So uh, it's, it's a question that's buzzing around the KHTS offices. We can't stop talking about it. What does Q stand for? Or is it just Q? Oh, it is. It does stand for something. My real name is Suzanne. Oh. And then it went to Susie. And then it went to Susie Q. Oh. And then it just went to Q. It's very showbiz. I wish I had a cool name like that. <laughs> yeah, it's 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 very cool. I, I like being Q. Yeah. I like being Q. I want to be Q Reed. <laughs> I might be going by Q Reed. So how crazy. Uh, we're talking with Q Reed, who's, of course, the center director of Mathnasium of Canning Country. How was it during the final couple of weeks of the semester? It was a little crazy. We had yeah. a lot of kids in there for getting ready for finals, but it's great. A lot of new faces? Some new faces. Some people came in just to get ready for the finals, but a lot of familiar faces and getting them ready for finals was really great. And then I get to hear all like, yes, I got a 90 or I got a 91 or I got a 98 or I got a 100. Those are the fun times. Right. Are the new faces the least prepared faces? Yes. There, there's some panic faces. Really? Yeah. Wow. I'm, I'm sure. I did. I got a couple of, of, oh my gosh, we only have two days. Can you do it? And that, that's when I say, I don't know if I can do it, but let's try. Let's give let's give it a go. So the Mathnasium method, you guys do an initial assessment to kind of gauge where the student's at. When a person only has two days, do you still do that initial no, assessment? I usually do private sessions. That's what I did with the two-day girl. Right. Uh, we just did a couple of private sessions and just to get her ready for her big uh her big test and that works well too we're talking with q reed center director of mathnasium of canaan country who doubles as a math tutor and a crisis navigator <laughs> as the semester winds down how is business during the summer it's different it's different i think that summer is the best time to catch kids up there's no homework right there's nothing on their back they just can come in and we can do a summer assessment which i think is a great plan especially for kids that are struggling come in we do a summer workout plan we do an assessment we figure out where the holes are then we can have a workout plan ready and we can hit it you know June, July, August, and get them ready for the next school year. I think it's the greatest plan. I'm a, I'm a big sports fan, and I often hear NBA players say this, that it's during the summer when they create separation between themselves and other players in the league, but when they're not caught up in the day-to-day -day goings on of team activities, they can kind of isolate where they need to get better and kind of just focus on individual routines, and I'm sure that's the same with, with I think math. It is. I think it is. I think it's the best time to – there's two – Students I work with, there's a rich enrichment students, and then there's two students that need to catch up. And in both places, the summer is is key. So, you are know. you guys usually open during the summer? Yes, is this a new are. thing? No, no, they're open during the summer. Wow, awesome! So, so basically, the how Mathnasium works, as I understand it, you pay a monthly fee, and you can come in as many times as you want. Yes. And it, the same thing applies during the summer. You can come well, in whenever. There's different things that we do in the summer. I, I put together, there's summer 12, summer 18, and summer 25. That way you can come in 12 times, 18 times, or 25 times instead of the paying monthly and coming in as many times, which you also can do if you plan on staying, which I'd love for kids to stay. Yeah. Some people only have the summer. Some people are very busy during the school year, and so they want to really uh, get some math during the summer. So we'd put those special special ones together for them. How about all the tutors that work? Because a lot of those tutors are students who can yes. kind of relate to these these uh, students, you know, as, as kids themselves. Are they traveling during the summer? Do you have a hard time with the amount of tutors that um, are on hand? No, they, they, they all want to be there. They want to work in the summer. And we're doing a, a really fun, we're starting in the summer at two o'clock and from two to three we're doing a game hour where all the tutors are playing games with the students which is kind of fun oh so that's all fun kind of want to be there right and so we play games for an hour and then from three to seven we do math but they all really want to be there they really love their job yeah so a couple months ago we had Rahit yeah who's a student at heart yes. I believe yeah and and he was he was going he was receiving acceptance letters I believe it was UCLA I think a couple Ivy League schools mm -hmm. were in there 
the, the semester the semester has finished. Yes. He's made his decision. Yes. Where is Rahit going? He's going to Santa Barbara, UC Santa Barbara. Oh, he's really? He's super excited because they have a great math program there. So he is all about math, and he is ready to go. So I'm very He's sad. all in. He's all in. Awesome. I'm, I'm sad I'm going to lose him, but he's not leaving until September, so we'll have him all summer long. Awesome. We're talking with Q Reed of Mathnasium, the center director of Mathnasium of Canyon Country. Of course, you can go to mathnasium.com slash Canyon Country for more info. You can also give him a call, 661-535-1976. That's not the number. No. Dude, you're giving me a look. That's <laughs> not the number. They sometimes put that on our um, – that's the – Why do they do that? I don't know. What, we, what's the number? It's 661-271-0226. 271-0226. See, I'm, I'm good with numbers, yeah, Q. Yeah, Mathnasium.com slash Caning Country. Also, the last time he came in, I was not here. Yeah. It was Ryan. It was Ryan. How was he? He was okay. He was okay. Was yeah. he better than me? No. He better not no, be. There's really I'm not gonna take my kid. better than you. Mm -mm. I, think you're, I think you're good. I think you've Thanks, Q. got job security here. Hey, so let me ask you. Do people, do non-students come? Because I would like to get better at math. I would, I would like to work my finances better. Are, are, are there continuing students? Yes that go to Mathnasium as well? I mean, they say that Mathnasium is um, K through 12, but I do have students come in that are in college. Awesome. Some kids, some students are, want to, they have to go take their college exam to get into college and they need some help. Things right. Like that. So yes, you can come. Q Reed of Mathnasium of Canyon Country. Again, mathnasium.com slash Canyon Country. And the phone number one more time because I forgot it already. I'm sorry, Q. <laughs> okay, 661-271-0226. Go check it out. Mathnasium of Canyon Country on Golden Valley Road, right opposite the Target Shopping Center. Right in the chart, Target oh, Center. Oh, right in the – Right by Staples. Drop off the kids. Leave yep. them there for a couple hours. Go shop at Target That's and right. uh, pick them up when, when you're done. Yeah. Mathnasium of Canyon Country. Mathnasium.com slash Canyon Country. Q, thanks for coming in. Always thanks, good seeing Aaron. you. You too. Of course.